Now in this video we're going to be looking through an example for compression so this is to prepare you for an exam uh, so a question like this can come up in an exam where we look at a whole frame and we try to pick out a member and we look at it uh, in close detail in order to determine its uh, design capacity so in this example we're given a frame such as the one shown here and uh, it's a steel structure and we're going to be looking at a particular column and whether it has enough design capacity uh, so the information given is that we're going to be using 250 UC 89.5 so the universal columns every single column will be a 250 UC 89.5 or the beams that we're going to be using are 310 UB 32.0 and an important thing to note is that we have cross bracing on this face going north to south and we have no bracing going east to west one thing that we also need to know is that the webs are orientated east to west so our webs go from east to west so across like this and our flanges for our beams are always horizontal so the flanges will lie flat um, what else is there? The, there's pin connections at the base in both directions so at the base of all the columns will be a pinned base in both directions so east and west, north and south and there will be flexible connections uh, north to south so going across this way there's flexible connections i.e. Uh, pin connections so on this face it will be